Hello, I'm Michael German, assistant editor for Design World magazine. I'm here today with Craig Lewis and Andrew Shad, uh, founders of Sprave Water. They're here today to talk about their new device, the new water monitoring device, Sprave. Welcome, gentlemen. Hey, thank you for having us. All right, why don't we begin with what is Sprave and how does it work? Sprave is a Bluetooth-enabled smart water meter for showers that can help consumers to save hundreds of dollars per year on their water bills by allowing them to reduce the amount of water and energy they use while they're in the shower. Uh, and we're actually using the concept of real-time feedback to achieve this goal. Okay, uh, how many different designs did you go through and what motivated those changes in the design? We went through uh, many different design iterations, three major um, distinct differences in design. First, we started off with uh, a simple shower head with a readout on it. And then we figured out, we found out that um, we needed to lower the visible, the, the side of line where you actually see this information. So we had a, a waterproof screen, flexible uh, cable that you can reposition in different heights for different users, uh, different, so different height showers. Um, and then we revisited after, after a school competition with some feedback. And uh, basically, we started with a clean slate. We, we looked at the, at the product and we figured, well, you know, there's a lot of really cool smartphone um, applicable products right now. And like, I think this could be a really cool um, like use for that. So basically, we, we, we wanted to give the user all the information the whole time, but we just want to streamline it this time. So right now in the shower, instead of getting all this information, if you have contacts or whatever, you're getting just the LED or the, or the, um, the sound cue. And then all the information that you ever want will be on the app. And that's really cool is because we're limited to having just one screen, one UI on the previous design, but now the design is limitless. We can have updates on our app, um, more features on the app for, for saving water and different things like that. So uh, now is what you see is the, um, this, this is the, the design we have now. It's really sleek, really small and compact. Um, it's, a, it's a droplet. It's, it, has like, it has our logo in the, in the DNA of the design. It's, it, um, it is what it's, it's, it's purposely designed just uh, we, we made the smallest part of it have uh, the LED on the top. So it's we really just kind of wanted to make it as, as, as uh, not invasive as possible and really wanted to complement, you know, be sleek, simple, and just sit um, right past the shower head. Okay, and uh, when designing this device, how are you keeping uh, manufacturing costs down? Uh, we're, we're doing this through a variety of, of different ways. Um, and and there is, there's some prior art out there that actually screws into the, uh, to the supply pipe behind the shower head. And that's, you know, initially one of the things we wanted to do. But, uh, you know, based off of kind of the price point uh, that we wanted to achieve, uh, to achieve competitive pricing, um, you know, we realized that it's expensive and complex to actually injection mold uh, threads. So with this, this clip-on design, it's actually uh, less expensive. Uh, there's only two components that need to be injection molded. Um, so, so really the way that it was designed and basically just thinking about, you know, what is the most effective way to convey the feedback to the user, uh, you know, led us away from the screen, which keeps costs down, uh, and it also led us to, to this design, uh, which is uh, less expensive to injection mold. And what sort of competition are you guys seeing uh, on the market for similar devices? Is there any competition? Uh, yeah, there's a variety of devices that are that are out there that do similar things. Um, you know, our device has has a, a really good value for money um, because you know there's some devices that give you feedback. There's there's some devices that have a screen, um, but but nobody you know really has the the combination of uh, like the smartphone integration uh, that our device has. You know, you can actually look at projections for your bills, uh, set goals, and actually alter the feedback on the device from your smartphone or tablet. Um, and that's kind of what, what separates us. Uh, and additionally, just the, the clip-on design, too, is, is one of the fastest and easiest ways to install a, a device like this. And what is your uh, overall goal for this device? What is it that you want it to accomplish? Uh, well, you know, there, there's a couple of different things that, that we want this to do. And, and, you know, first of all, you know, there's a huge potential for, for savings and just to basically increase home efficiency. Uh, you, know, you know, people... People don't necessarily want to, you know, use water energy ineffectively, but, you know, in the shower, it's difficult to actually monitor your utility consumption. Uh, so our device can help to do that. But, but additionally, you know, this can kind of 
start a conversation about about water conservation and using energy effectively by putting the data in a high visibility place like the smartphone. You know, in, in, in really small activities like showering, they can have huge aggregate effects. So, you know, if everybody in the United States cut their shower time by uh, an average of one minute for a year, there would be uh, a decrease in carbon emissions. It would be the equivalent of taking six million cars off the road. Um, so, you know, this can have huge environmental effects as well. All right, and uh, if people wanted to learn more about Sprave or uh, donate to its Kickstarter, uh, where would they go to find that information? Uh, yeah, you can find us at uh, spravewater.com, uh, S-P-R-A-V, uh, water.com, and then that can uh, redirect you to the Kickstarter site. And also, you can, you can go to kickstarter.com and just search uh, Sprave. All right, well, thank you for coming in today, gentlemen. Yeah, thanks for having us. All right, stay up to date on the latest engineering news by visiting www.designworld.com or by following us on Twitter with the handle at DesignWorld. My name is Michael German. Have a good day.